Hi, I'm Camilla, and this is King, and we're the Fire Resellers. And today we are unboxing 100 pounds of Thread Up Men's Let's Rescue go. Box. So we ordered 100 pounds from Thread Up, and we are going to compare it to the 99 pounds that we got from the Austin bins mm -hmm. a couple weeks ago. And so we are going to unbox here with you, and then at the end we'll do a little bit of a recap. By the way, Thread Up sent us these you know like very inconspicuous boxes two, huge two 50 boxes. pound boxes and they're not messing around i know it's, no no tissue paper no polka, no polka dots. dots in the back or you know it's like come on all business. business so let's just jump right into it okay so first we have these are some men's um they look like work pants and they are new with tags they're they look like they're in a good size natural issue yeah natural issue um which i've never heard of that brand before but, you know, new tags should be pretty good and in a nice good size. So, we'll mm. see how that does. Oh, we've got some shoes. Nice. Oh, so, look at this. these look like... Equipment Adidas. Adidas. Nice. Cool. They look brand new. Yeah, they do. Oh, look, they've got new tags. So. Oh, cool. Ortholite. Nice. These are looking pretty fresh. We're pretty excited about Those that. Those should be good. How much did we spend on this? Over $400. Yeah, so. it, was, it was $400 plus tax. But shipping was free, so, you know, that's pretty good. Free shipping. It better. <laughs> okay, this says PJ Tour. So a golfing uh, polo. Pretty big size. Usually, we like to sell larger sizes mm -hmm. in men's. Looks got like a few some ties. ties. Brooks Brothers. Yeah, this one is Brooks Brothers as well. Yeah, these all look like silk. The patterns aren't so bad. Yeah, this Stripe. one is pretty cool. Not so bad. This one looks like a teacher tie to me. Oh, yeah. Moving on, we've got Ralph, Ralph Lauren. Lauren. The regular Ralph Lauren tag which is you know higher than lauren ralph lauren and polo ralph lauren so it's kind of mid-tier another new with tags item academics never heard of it look at these funky backs or the pockets oh yeah oh, that's look at, cool look at this front too yeah these this going on here these look pretty cool What's, and it's like a, um, a fur trim almost yeah i don't, I don't know. know what this it's is it's kind of hard to describe i wonder if it's, this is like a bigfoot or something like i'm not teddy. sure it's almost as though um it's, it's like a plush feel <laughs> yeah. to so let me show you the tag real quick. Academics. Really Pretty funky. funky. <laughs> We're going to have to do some research. Yeah. It says John Henry and it still has the Marshalls tag <laughs> yeah. on it. So another pair of work pants. Retail price $48. I don't know if this is much of anything, but yeah. I'll show you anyway. Okay. Another new tags, um, men's. Periellis. It says MSRP $65. I doubt yeah. we're going to get anything close to that yeah we don't usually pick up perry ellis when we see it at the bins we see it pretty often at the bins but we don't pick it up okay an orvis quarter zip is it quarter yeah just a quarter so that should do pretty well orvis is a pretty good brand to be on the lookout for they do have some items that are sold at costco so you have to be careful but this seems like it's pretty nice so. american eagle american eagle <laughs> nice okay well the good thing about this one is that it's very soft so uh -huh. yeah we might, I might take this into like a Buffalo Exchange or something. They are always looking for men's basic stuff. This is a hundred pounds and I'm going to try to cut this video up so that it's not too, too long. Really, you want our analysis yeah. of if this is right. better than the bins right. that you hopefully watched last week. So yeah. that haul is there for you in the corner. If you want to check it out, please do. This one is... Hagar hey, Black Label. Just <laughs> another <laughs> pair of work pants. Banana Republic Linen Cotton. So this says Campia Sport. It's kind of funky. It's got it's kind of a like pretty a Hawaiian. Cool, yeah, print to it. Yeah. So it's also it new is, with tags. Yeah, new with tag. So that's got it going for it. Okay. We've got Hugo, Hugo Boss. Oh, look at that. It says Hugo kind of backwards. So if you look oh, in the mirror, I think that should show Hugo. So interesting. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, it's new with tags, which is yeah. good. So. It seems like we're getting a lot of new with tags. John Barbatos. This wow, is $178 who for Who would pay $178 a, a dollars for a t-shirt? What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, can we get maybe a quarter of that? Yeah. That would be good. We'll Dockers pleated original khaki. Big and tall, Big which and is tall. good. So, brand new tag. Yeah. Uh, underground oh. is from uh, the UK, England. Uh -huh. It's, you know, their the subway system. Subway system. Feels nice. Oh, yeah. Cool. Columbia. This yeah. looks really nice. Full zip. Yeah. yeah, feels really nice. Feels substantial. Brand new with tag. Big and tall. Marshalls. <laughs> then, then Houston. Oh, then yeah. Houston Studio. Yeah. New with tag. Nice. Eh. 44 MSRP. Yikes. So far, it's just uh, okay. So Under Armour. 
a long sleeve. Yeah, it looks almost like a base layer. And then this is Nike Golf. Oh, nice. Which should do pretty well. Oh, it's a long sleeve. Got nice. Ralph Lauren, a nice striped long sleeve button down. Mm -hmm. You know, this is one of those types of experiences where you really challenge yourself to mm -hmm. learn about men's items. Because yeah. as you probably already know, we deal mostly with women's items and we're really trying to get into more men's clothing because that category in secondhand clothing is growing a lot faster than women's clothing so yeah. definitely something to be thinking about as you're outsourcing we will probably list a lot of these online we might take some into buy sell trade stores because often they are looking for more men's items than women's items they mm -hmm. get a lot more women coming in trying to sell their clothes than they get men but also we're gonna try to list some of it online. But if you want anything from what we're showing here, let us know. We'll yeah, give let you us good know. Deal. Or if you need to know the size of something, anything like that. Yeah. American Eagle. American Eagle. Yeah, good fellow and co. Great. Yeah, that's No, this is Target. Target. I'm pretty sure. But they are cargo shorts, which are actually a pretty good category. Express. Express. New attack. Wow. This looks like old school. Like it reminds me of like the early 2000s or kind like everyone like a, was wearing like one of these in affliction the style yeah, exactly <laughs> eddie bauer nice that should so, do pretty well not too bad it's like a flannel it looks pretty warm yeah we are pretty picky about our eddie bauer when we're at the bins and things we'll pick up some of it but not all of it adidas it looks like golfing oh, shorts yeah, golf shorts feels like that type of material mm -hmm. anyway oh another pair oh these are pants oh cool so i think probably adidas golf pants. ones mm -hmm. yeah athletic works no so, idea just an athletic sort of top, athletic works. We see this brand pretty often at the bins and we never pick it up. Maybe we'll learn something from these boxes that, you know, things that we wouldn't pick up in the past we're going to start picking up. Yeah. Because we'll learn something. That's happened so, quite a lot in the past where we've mm -hmm. gotten a few other men's that are breast food box. So this is a great way for mm -hmm. educating ourselves. Right, exactly. Athletics. Athletics, interesting. So some sweatpants look pretty nice. Cool. Yeah, this is what that tag like looks like. Joggers. So here we have a Chicago baseball jersey. We're not sure which team it's from. Yeah, we'll have to do a little bit of research. Yeah. If you are from Chicago, please let us know. Yeah. Let us know that you're from Chicago, but also let us know what <laughs> yeah. that team is. Yeah, what that team <laughs> Yeah. Okay, champion. Uh, look, the tag is even kind of worn. I know. So yeah. This oh, one's well. kind of a dud. Let's see, Tommy, Tommy Bahama. Bahama. It's a quarter zip. So. Yeah, we pick up some Tommy Bahama stuff. Like, we would maybe pick this up at the bins. So, we'll see. We'll see how that does. A vintage sport coat. It's, it's by the brand Bruno Carpini. So I don't know if that is anything. We gotta figure that out. Another golf pants by Adidas. Nice. Maybe we can lot this up if it's the yeah. same size. Yeah, we'll so, try. Not bad. Another Express button up. We don't sell, we honestly leave most button ups behind at the bins because they are really saturated online, yeah. men's button ups. Because every man has like a thousand of them, it seems like. And all of a sudden they retire and they want to get rid of all of them. So, you know, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, yeah. this is really cute. This little um, it's Land's, Land's End. End, a sweater vest. This I could really see Buffalo Exchange taking, but they would probably place it in the women's section. Another pair of Adidas golf pants. Let's hope that these yeah. are also the same size. But look at these, these pink pockets. That's so interesting. Hot pink. Hot pink pockets. <laughs> Some Izod Relax Chino, MSRP $50. If we can get yeah. $20, we'd be happy. Some more Van Heusen, big and tall. Oh my gosh. But hopefully it's the same size as the other one that looks kind of like this, so we can both line them up. First wave swim, swim trunks, and they look like maybe teen, kind of like younger boy sizing because hmm. of how skinny the waist is. Starter brand, just kind of a workout top. Craft and borrow, a little Argyle, Argyle. sweater. Jinx. Van, Van Houston. Oh okay, we gosh. never pick up Van Houston in the stores. But not even new a tag. Oh not even gosh. new a tag. Yeah. Look, it's a Nike hoodie. It's cool. pretty lightweight. Yeah. Pretty nice. Yeah, we might have to with some of these button-up shirts. We might have to find a charity that helps you know people try to find jobs and wear things for interviews and things like that. Well, that's probably what we'll end up doing if you know it's not really worth our time to sell these items because most of them are in good condition we haven't seen any stains or anything this is american eagle looks uh, like the amazingly same. soft so nice. very soft actually and i like it sport tech just some um, shorts they were probably someone's basketball shorts with their uniform lame american eagle again yep just a stripe button up oh my gosh oh well free, free planet. planet jinx mm. so Oops. hooded long sleeve new tag yeah. This tag is actually very nice. Yeah. MSRP, $58. We'll 
take another look at that one. Yeah. The Men's Store Bloomingdale's. All right, some, a Bloomingdale sweater. We sold some Bloomingdale sweaters before and they've done actually pretty well. We'll probably price this around like $25 and be able to sell it like that. So a Banana Republic, this looks like a, like almost like a coat. Hmm. Um, very thick sweater. Yeah, very thick sweater, 100% cotton. So not great material, but not bad. Allison Athletic, just another, another pair of athletic shorts, Uniqlo. Oh, Uniqlo. So yeah. these are pretty thick pants and I don't know. They seem kind of nice. Yeah, Uniqlo is like on the same level as like H&M and stuff. Joe Marlin from Ross. Yeah. Don't this was obviously a gift to someone, I think, because <laughs> they cut off all the prices. <laughs> Pretty it's, cool. It's a Nautica. Really big, uh, big and tall, probably, type yeah. of polo. Yeah. That's cool. I I could see this selling because it's so interesting. Oh, another Brand cool new. Layers. Joseph. Joseph A. Bank, Joseph Bank. Look, and they don't need their socks that they probably bought at the same time. <laughs> you want some new socks for Christmas? No. Merry Christmas. No, <laughs> I don't want socks <laughs> for Christmas. What's on your up. Christmas list this, this year? Let us know in the comments. If they're socks, maybe we'll send those to you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I have no idea what this brand is. It's just ITC? a polo. We'll probably take this into, I feel like I could see some guy who has just a mustache wearing that. You know what I mean? <laughs> okay, Nike Golf. Another Nike Golf polo. Maybe it's the same size as the other one that we got. So we'll see if we can lock those up. Royals baseball. Oh, okay. Kansas, Kansas City. City Royals. It's a Nike brand as well. So a maybe that'll fit. do well. Old Navy Active says making waves. Not much of anything. Yeah, probably not worth much. Joseph Abood. Oh my gosh. It's a quarter zip. Quarter zip. Joseph Abood Abood. Okay. Another pair of khakis. Uh, Adriano Goldschmied. Made oh, in the okay. USA. Pretty We've good. sold that before. We would yeah. probably pick these up. Yeah, we would pick up a John Goldschmidt pretty Looks much like any day. Looks like a good day. size, too. Yeah, the protege streak. So, nice. not so bad. ASOS design. It's just a plain old long sleeve. Wait, it's yeah. a short sleeve. It's a big, big boy. Big so old short sleeve. Jeez. I think that might be a woman's. I don't think men's sizes are like 18. Like ASOS. Something. I'm reminded of women's clothing with ASOS, so <clears throat> maybe they're women's after all. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Okay, the last Amazing. item of this box. Okay, so far, halfway through. Uh, I'd say it's okay. It's not that... I, like, I think we can get $200 out of that and make our money back. Oh, yeah, for sure. I think it's brands that we might pick up, like Ralph Lauren, you know, Adidas, Nike, that sort of thing. But a lot of the, you know, kind of button-ups that we got, we wouldn't necessarily pick up. Or like the work pants, we would not pick those up. We'll have to lot up a lot of these of the same yeah. brand. See if we can get yeah. our money back with right. some of these. We're going to go ahead and calculate kind of the cost per item near the end. We're going to count them mm -hmm. all up and then we'll let you know how it costs. Yeah, exactly. Okay, so let's open the second box. Adidas, cool. again. Hey, not bad. Okay, yeah. well, okay. give us a second. We'll settle in. <laughs> <laughs> We're just going to put this all in the same video. We're going to edit, chop it up and yeah. see if we can get through this. Yeah, hopefully. We don't want to make this two videos. This is hauls for days, okay? If you didn't already watch those other two videos, this is part of that series. This is the third video out of four. So yeah. check it out. Yeah. So these are some Adidas new tags, just like the other ones. They are the Ortholite type. Very cool. We're really excited about these. I think these will bring in a lot of money. Old Navy boxers. <laughs> if you need some new undies, we've got you. <laughs> Size medium. Let's see, the tie bar. Brooke Brothers, Makers, All Silk, Tommy Hill figure. So, yeah. patterns, not so bad. With all the Brooks Brothers ones, we'll probably end up lining those up. Mm -hmm. See if we can get maybe $20 for all of them. Yeah, they look like them. Um, LB, UB, I'm not sure. They look Take kind look of like this. hiking pants, like they're they're like sporty, sort of, mm -hmm. but I'm not totally sure. All right, the thing's finally looking up. We'll see. We'll see, Ralph Lauren. Yeah, so we'll probably see if all of our Ralph Lauren shirts are the same size and we'll lot them up if they are. It'll also help us get through this clothing because right. 100 pounds of stuff, that's a lot. This one is also new with tags. PJ Tour, another golf shirt. Cool. Polo, golf polo. Polo by Ralph Lauren. A little sweater vest. Hmm. That's cute. St. John's Bay. Yeah. It was on clearance for ten nineteen, so <laughs> we'll price it at nine nineteen <laughs> when we put it online. No, just kidding. That's just a uh, fleece. Covington. Brand new. Yep. $32 from Sears.com. Nice. Banana Republic Supima 120s. I don't know. Maybe that's something. Probably It's a pretty nice count. white shirt, though. Everyone yeah. needs a good white shirt. Banana Republic Relax. Hey, it's new with tag, in a way. Yeah. So, 
Not so bad. Looks like a very old tag from Banana Republic, but <laughs> size large. <laughs> Pretty good size though. Yeah. Another pair of work pants. Or no, these are shorts. St. John's, John's, John's Bay. Oh my gosh. Again, yeah. Yikes, those pleats on there. Yikes. Yikes. Who's sending this stuff into thread up anyway? Like, I don't know. come on. <laughs> New tag dockers. So we'll try to mount those up with the other ones. Gold mark denim. Oh, those look pretty fancy. Nice. So we'll have to do some research on this. Yeah, they feel. They feel good. If there's anything substantial that comes up, we'll try to put a comp on on yeah. the screen. I bet that's vineyard vines. Yeah. How did you know that? Vineyard Cause, vines. Because this little this salmon color is so vineyard vines. Yeah. So that should if do you well. Don't already know this tag. That's vineyard vines. It's kind of a preppy type uh, yeah. brand, and it does pretty okay. Yeah, we don't often pick it up at the bins, um, but I think you could. Mm -hmm. Ralph, Ralph Lauren. Lauren. Top. I don't know how I feel about this yeah. spending four hundred dollars. So, <laughs> though to be fair, those Adidas shoes might be something kind of just mind blowing. Yeah. So we'll see. Taylor Stitch. Oh, oh cool. okay. All right, all, all right. right. Some Taylor new tags. Taylor Stitch pants. Okay, these should do really well. Wow, there's if size thirty two. Have followed us lately. We've been having some really good luck selling Taylor Stitch. Mm -hmm. It's a, definitely a bolo men's yeah. brand. One hundred twenty five. We'll actually probably shoot for like 80 mm -hmm. for something like this. Yeah, we'll have to see how the pants do, but the shirts sell for about 40 to $50. Very high quality brand. Mm -hmm. Great resale value. It's Matrix, Matrix, but it's, like it's kind of like Matrix, but without the R. Exactly. That's what I, was <laughs> I feel like I could bring this into like a Buffalo Exchange. New Tag, Perry Ellis, Travel Lux. Well, it looks probably. like we're getting some good doubles. So we will be definitely wadding a lot of these up. Someone must have had like some stash of all sorts of new tags items. Like maybe they had a shopping addiction or something. And then someone sent them in to thrown up. Because look at all these things with new tags. And a lot of them are the same size. Yeah. These are I, some Land's End pants. They look like maybe hiking pants. They're kind of like cargo. They're really lightweight. Yeah. Nice. Oh, nice. Oh, they roll up too. Greg Norman, new tag. So Greg Norman... Pretty okay brand. Yeah. MSRP, $85. I don't know that anyone ever pays $85 for Greg Norman. But... Yeah, I feel like it's always at TG Maxx or like, I feel like I would see it at Steinmart and it'd be like super discounted. <laughs> yeah, Armani minute. Exchange. Armani. Some Armani is... pleather pants. <laughs> oh so we'll gosh. see how these do. So if you want to have a rocker phase, you can get these. That'd be so fun. A guarantee of quality for hurt, for hurty. For hurty, we're not sure. Yeah, I'm not sure. So, you would think that my Irish heritage would help me, but it doesn't here. <laughs> the raw uncut. So it looks like kind of like a surfer just, sort of. Yeah, pretty lightweight, pretty nice. Yeah. Shirts and skins. Just seems like yeah. basketball shorts. Rip curl. Some really, what seems to be a very lightweight shorts. Yeah. So pretty nice. Cinque. I'm not oh, sure. Polo. So, yeah, it's a polo. Here, yeah. why don't you take a look and let us know if mm -hmm. we said it right yeah h&m linen okay all right all right, That's all, right okay. all right linen is good h&m is just okay gap gap okay M made, made with, with linen. linen i could see that doing okay the modern oxford gap Ugh. okay 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 all these button-ups okay okay We're working through it Some jeans polo ralph lauren brand new this 35 30 slim. Eh. distressed heavily yeah we'll see We'll yeah, we'll see how that goes. Calvin Klein jeans. Okay. Pretty good condition, but not new with tags. I bet that those are similar to the other ones that we had. Yeah, I think so. And the other backs. Yeah. That's interesting. Some tie dye. Feels pretty nice. Ah, oh, Hollister. Hollister. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, Hollister. I mean, it's still trendy. Maybe we'll sell this on Depop. I don't know. Maybe the kids on Depop will be like, why are you selling Hollister on here? I don't know. I'm not on Depop. We were thinking about it. Today we were talking about getting on Depop. Are you on Depop? Let us know what your thoughts are on Depop. Yeah, let us know if that would sell on Depop. <laughs> yeah. Another Nord button Trump. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. Interesting. I don't know. I don't, I don't really love this pattern. I think it's kind of outdated, but we'll see. St. John's Bay. Another one. But this is a, like a waffle knit. We'll probably bring this in to like put us closet and stuff. So another pair of basketball shorts. Oh my gosh. Okay. Keep going. <laughs> Maybe we'll lot them up. Maybe we'll lot up all the basketball shorts. Yeah. Even if they're not the same size, we'll just lot them up. Like, it's a shirt. <laughs> it's, <already> it's just <laughs> a pigeon. <laughs> okay. All right. Vineyard vines. All right. A vineyard vine sweater. That should be nice. Feels pretty nice. Yeah. The other thread up boxes that we got, we didn't get that many like 
professional things, and this one we're getting like almost all professional yeah. items. So interesting. It says, hey band, so or hot band. I'm not sure. It's just another pair of pants. Yeah, professional. Pants. Taylor Stitch. All hey, right, here another we go. new attack, Taylor Stitch. Maybe oh, this oh will save gosh. the entire box. Yeah, the entire I, two I bet boxes. that we could make our money back with the two Taylor Stitches and the two shoes and then the rest would all be just profit arrow 1987 yep aeropostal link vineyard vines another one yep size just medium a button up all right I, I think we're gonna be lining up quite a lot of these items <laughs> tommy hill figure another pattern. button up yeah. yeah a brand maybe pronounced kovara yep. another pair of pants work pants work so pants. many work pants Work shirt. Oh my gosh. Another Jose Bank. Maybe we'll line it up with the other Jose Bank oh that we gosh. got. Greater than sports. Well, we'll mm. see how that does. We've never heard of that brand. GTS. We'll have to look it up. Yes. Yeah. Mark Anthony. Mm. Is that a good brand? I don't know. I was working at the thrift store the other day. I was um, volunteering and they had this brand and it felt really nice. I mean, yeah, this one it, feels, it feels really nice. It feels pretty nice. But the tag looks like maybe a dog ate it. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit, so I don't know that you could oh, say it's, it's a new Kohl's attack. brand. Oh, okay. This one's new attack. Mark Anthony again. Yep. So we'll let you know if it, it's anything substantial. I doubt it if it's a Kohl's brand. Another Mark Anthony? Nope. It's Croft and Borrow. <laughs> Even worse, it seems, it seems like. I think that just, also might be a Kohl's brand. We just see it a lot. And I think it's, it's a Kohl's brand. Men's Claiborne Pants. Yep. This is terrible. <laughs> Polo by Ralph Lauren. 100% cotton. These actually do pretty well. We usually sell these for about twenty dollars. Express, Express, another button up. This is a kind of a cute style with the stripes. Another Express. Express, but New this tag. is floral. That's very funky. Fun. Oh yeah, a little penguin polo. Not so bad. So I mean, penguin is kind of bits here. So yeah, that's it's okay. okay. We've sold some of it that we've gotten from friends. So the North Face. Oh my that's, gosh. It's okay. This pattern is really ugly though. So this is new attack hawk it says right here oh, tony really? hawk nice. so 24 dollars. i bet we can get 10 15. Yeah, that's american cool. eagle uh. some swim trunks ombre action that's cute polo, polo association new attack yeah pretty nice print actually i kind of like this levi's premium brand new attack yeah i think is this the first levi's item that we've got yeah yeah the first one that Very we've gotten in, the, in this box very surprising. MSRP seventy nine fifty. Five so. 11s. Nike dry fit shorts. You know, just a lightweight type. Is that everything? Yeah, that's everything. A little note from Third <laughs> Up that says, "Do not send any of this back to us." <laughs> just kidding. That is everything. That was a lot. We're gonna put down here how much we paid for each item and kind of the total of how much we think that we could get for these two boxes. Mm -hmm. And you know, last week we put up a haul from the bins, and we had gone. We spent about. Six hours actually at the bins, five hours driving, two and a half there, two and a half back. It's kind of the same amount of money um, if we were to like pay ourselves, you know, for the time that we spent actually mm -hmm. picking. So we said that we would make probably 2500 2500 Yeah. We'll see how that goes. Yeah. So we'll see how that goes. But that then goal. this estimate is using kind of the same parameters that we were estimating with that. So, mm -hmm. you know, it is kind of comparing apples to apples a little bit. So... Is it really better, you know, than going to the bins? So you'll have to tell us, yeah. you know, you know, this is nice. It's not that much more expensive than the bins, you know, comparatively. So Cause this your time is, is worth a lot of money. Yeah, you know? this is definitely an option. I think for people who are short on time, this is a great way to get a lot of inventory all at once. You know, you don't have to go anywhere. You don't have to, you know, like if you have kids and things like that. So it depends on your situation, you know, right? kind of make a, an informed decision based off of watching videos like this mm -hmm. where we show you so you yeah. don't have to spend the money right but then the thing with thread up boxes is you know you can watch our video and you can say wow they got a really good box you can watch someone else's video and they get really terrible box right you can order it and you get like an amazing box and then the next time you order it you get a terrible box so it's really up to whoever is packing the box and whatever they have in like their warehouse whatever right. So it is hard because you don't have much control over it. Whereas at the bins, you are controlling exactly what you're putting near your cart and exactly what you're checking out with. You're not controlling what's in the bins themselves, but you're controlling what you're picking. So Yeah, there were a lot of reasons for us to have chosen this particular set of boxes because we could have gotten a different hundred pounds where mm -hmm. it was mixed clothing and it would have been a lot cheaper. <laughs> It would have yeah. been like, $200. like half the price. But the thing about the men's box versus like the mixed box, 
And the reason we chose the men's box is that because ThreadUp doesn't accept any men's clothing, like the mix box, they're taking out what they actually want to sell. Mm -hmm. And then the stuff that they're sending you is the, basically their rejects. Yeah. So, I mean, yes, you can maybe get some good things because, yes, maybe they're not going through everything that they receive. However, with ours, we are getting everything. Like, if they sold men's things, we definitely would not have gotten these Taylor Stitch pants. Like, right. they would have sold those, you know, and things like that. So, that's just our decision-making thought process behind all of this, but you might make a different decision for yourself. Anyway, that's our analysis of it all. Mm -hmm. um, we'd love to hear your comments down below of what your vote is for, a thread up or the bins and why, you know, why you think that. Yeah. Um, we'd love to, you know, kind of have a really good discussion in the comments. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully you'll join us for mm -hmm. the other video that we're doing next week too. Mm -hmm. You know, hauls for days. Yeah. And if you like seeing unboxings like these ones, give this video a like that tells us that you like this type of content mm -hmm. and that we should make more videos like this, then maybe we should order another one. I kind of want to order another one. This is kind of fun. Let us know if you think we should order another one by liking this video. And if you aren't subscribed, consider subscribing because then you'll be, you know, in the loop if we do order another <laughs> box and you can see us open that one right. as well. And definitely subscribe and join us on our What's Sold videos. We do that each week. It's great getting all these things, but you definitely want to know what's selling. So yeah, join us next week for Hauls for Days and we'll see you later. Bye! Okay, so first we have, these are some men's, um, they look like work pants, new way tags, um, men's. Periellis. Yeah, work All pants. All these are men's. Oh yeah, yeah, duh. Sometimes they might throw something, a women's something in here. Adidas, new tag, just like the other ones. I think I fit these. I might fit these. Where would you wear them? These aren't your style at all. I can be cool, I can be hip. Mm, I don't know about that.